All right, guys, Equip Expo 2023. It is finally here. I cannot wait to jump inside and show you guys everything that's going on. I'm a little bit late to the game. I gotta run inside there. I'm gonna do my best over the next couple days to bring you guys as much content as possible, but let's go jump inside. We'll see what Equip Expo 2023 is all about. All right, guys, so over at the Yakut booth, we're hanging out with Brody. Check it out. What do we got going on, brother? Yeah, thank you very much. So we're here at Equip Expo for the very first time. What you can see right in front of us here is that we got our commercial unit, our YXR 910. We also have our YXR 710 units. The biggest thing that you're gonna be able to go and find with our units is that our units split in two. And what we mean by that is that by the pull of a lever, the front will come right off. Then you back up and you can go right on to a snowblower like you see here. You can go on to different size decks. You also can go on to a leaf blower, an aerator, a front end loader, a grader, you name it, we're gonna have it all. So it's really one unit that could do five to 10 jobs. There's gonna be a lot coming. On the other side, you're gonna be able to go and see or even our stand on units or more residential units. And then we also have a larger booth where you can go and see the different engines that we go and put together and the units actually split apart so you can see how the mechanics go and work. So from becoming a lawnmower to a snowblower, walk from our commercial units to our prosumer units and then just around the corner here if you follow me you can see our stand-on unit wow and then what we go quote unquote our more residential unit which is far from a residential unit it's built as heavy if not heavier than most commercial units out there with that's, the yxr 510 that's awesome all right brother where can people find more information uh yakta.com or follow us on social we're on them all all right thanks brody awesome All right guys, we're over here at the Earthway booth. It's day number two, the doors just open. By the way, right up front, your Earthway booth, those doors open and everybody came at you guys. Yes, that's awesome. so fun. The energy today is already amazing. Heck yeah, uh, this is Jennifer. A lot of you guys know the Earthway uh, brand and some of the products that we were promoting in the winter, but um, how's the booth going? Awesome, we just, we love all the energy that everybody brings to Equip Expo every year. Yeah. And so excited to showcase our winter goods, especially since we're moving into that season. Uh, you want a little tour of what we got going on? Uh, Earthway, cedars, spreaders, snow shovels, like a great brand, great product. A lot of you guys saw those blue shovels the last couple winters. Those are a game changer. Then those little uh, metal cutting edge shovels you get at Home Depot. Don't do that. Check these guys out instead. Uh, so what do we got, girl? So we've got our high output salt spreaders. So these are perfect for commercial applications and residential needs. We've got sizes for everybody. Yep. Easy to throw on and off the truck. My output's gonna work through your rock salt with the There you go. Oh, this is our flagship item. We have people that are great grandparents have passed these down. It's our garden cedar. It's gonna plant your seeds with precision. They're gonna be properly spaced the whole way through. Alright. And there's the pushers. Here's, that our, here's the pushers. About. Let's talk about these. We've got these, what are 36 and 30? Uh 24 up to 48. Holy cow. Uh, which ones do I have? I have the 30, right? I think 30 or 36. So I, that's the 30 and 36. Right yeah, here. these are a game changer. Like the snow just wind rose right off. Uh, not to give you guys a whole pitch, but please, please, please invest in a shovel. I know they're a little bit more expensive than what you get at Home Depot, but there's a reason, okay? Everybody has these poly yep, shovels. I, yep, they're high impact resistant. Yeah. The snow is just going to flow right off. Yeah, our, ours are still going great two seasons straight. All right. Anything else? All the handheld yep, stuff? Yeah, we've got all the handheld stuff. We've got the chest yep. spreaders, the bag seat. Yeah. Everything for the whole crew. Where can people get more information? Earthway.com is the best place to go. And Brian Stenz still save you 10%? Yep. Rock and roll. All right. No pitch here. Not sponsored. <laughs> We're just hanging out here. Um, I got a bunch of booths to go check out, but I saw Jennifer and I said, hey, how's it going? Let's do a video. So that's what yeah, I got. Perfect. Yeah. All right, girl. Great to see you. Thanks so much. All right. Let's keep it going, guys. All right. We're at the John Deere booth. Check out all the mowers going on over here. By the way, love the neon green underneath. These guys have redesigned a couple of the mowers, if I'm not mistaken, including the stand-ons. Let's go check that out really quick i know you guys are always like i want to see more john deere all right i got you look at that green light by the way that's awesome all right so here is the new stand on if i'm not mistaken i don't know anything about the john deere's this is the q865r it's very loud at this booth so i apologize if the audio is a little choppy here's your cutting deck and platform throttle i would imagine your parking brake Let's see, PTO, cool screen, 
What are we rocking here? Kawasaki probably. Alright, and your cutting height. Dual tanks. There you go. And the cool thing, they got, I think those are twheels, the Michelin twheels. But that is awesome to see those airless tires on the John Deere. You guys gotta get those. All right, here is the uh, stand-on. This is the Q810E. 30, maybe 36 inch platform. That's pretty sharp. And then let's do one other one. We've got the 820M. Look at this bracing up here. All right, well, that's pretty cool. And they got a accelerated bagger or one of their own. I'm not sure. Well, that's cool, a little side discharge. All right, well, there you go, guys. That's the John Deere's that I can uh, at least help you guys out with. Look at their booth. This thing is jam-packed. Always a good time. All right, that's what I got. Let's keep going, guys. Hello, Christian. What's hey, up? Ryan, what's up? How's it going? Good. How are you, buddy? Good. How are you? Look at the hair. Thank you. Doing after you, right? Hey, look. <laughs> we both got some good looking hair today. We must both be doing something important. What are you doing today? Oh, just talking with people. That's it. I got something over at Snow X and then a couple different booths. But yeah. There you go. Yeah, absolutely. All right. Business good? Everything's good. All right, bud. Absolutely. We'll, we'll catch up with you. Yeah, catch up with you, Brian. All right, guys. Really quick, special guest over here. What is up, Mr. Top Notch? Yeah. What is up, dude? Oh no, man, just hanging out at the expo. <laughs> Meeting cool guys like you. Whatever, bro. You are like one of the OG, OG, OGs. Uh, I grew up watching you, uh, B and B, um, and Spencer. I didn't even see Spencer's really? channel. No, it, actually, ironically, that was like literally never promoted to me. Uh, Ambro. Yeah. Remember Jason Ambro? Yes, I do. But you were uh, doing the vlogs. B and B was doing the stripes. It's been a long time. How long have we known each other? Seven, eight years? Six, uh, seven years? Yeah, good while. Wow. What's up? Uh, what's new? How's everything going, brother? Man, just kind of the same old, same old. Doing the tall lawn stuff. Not Heck. doing the vlogs no more. Just trying to help people out. Yeah. Yeah, man. It's been fun. You enjoying the show? Oh, yeah. And uh, this is your son, Tyler. My son, Tyler. Hey, Tyler. Hi. You having a good show? It's a fine, yeah. Awesome, man. We were just catching up for about 10 minutes here. I got to get run into another booth for a little interview thing, whatever that is. But um, hey, just want to say thank you. Thanks yeah. for all your content. I honestly don't know if I'd be doing YouTube if it wasn't for like you, you and B&B. &B. Uh -huh. For real. Because I was like, hey, if that guy can do it, I can do it. And you were so relatable so far back then. And it's awesome to see you still around and still kicking butt. Well, that I will say. If I can do it, anybody uh, can do it. Whatever, Trust me. whatever, dude. All right. <laughs> hey, appreciate you. Thank uh, you. Kick butt. Do those videos. And uh, we'll catch up with you soon. All right, buddy. All right, brother. Thanks, guys. All right, guys. We're over here at the Billy Goat booth. Check out all of their products. Look at that scaffolding, like, tower thing. That's awesome. A lot of you guys saw the Leaf Dragon last year. We're going to be doing a little uh, panel discussion in just a quick minute, but you got to enjoy uh, coming out here, checking out the Briggs and Stratton booths and all the stuff that these guys have to offer. There you go, Vanguard. To everybody in attendance here today at the Briggs and Stratton display, where passion powers innovation. My name is Shane Andrews, and it's my pleasure to bring you all of our stage presentations here today with some of the most influential people and some of the best in the business that are going to offer their insights and share some stories about their businesses and what they do within the outdoor power equipment industry. So let's get things started here today on day number two as our first guest comes from Wixom, Michigan as he's the owner of Brian's Lawn Maintenance. Please welcome Brian Fullerton. I'm doing well, Brian. How are you today? Hey, living the dream. Things are good, and uh, the show is absolutely packed out. Oh, it is. It's a great turnout here today, day number two. And we've got some exciting products and brands here in the Briggs and Stratton display. We say passion powers innovation, and you definitely have a passion for this industry, don't you? Well, I mean, to be honest with you, this is all I've done with my life for 20 you know, plus years. I got started in the green industry back when I was 10, 12 years old. Had a couple different careers along the way, but at 18, 19, I went back into the green industry and 17 plus years later. So we've made a lot of money along the way. We've made a lot of mistakes along the way. Uh, we're helping a lot of people have a better lawn and landscaping business. So I guess you could say we're a little passionate about the industry. Well, hey, thanks for having me. And guys, appreciate you watching. If we can do anything to help you out, give us a shout, shoot us an email. Always like, comment, subscribe. We'll catch up with you guys here on the next one. Brian Fullerton, ladies and gentlemen, from Wixom, Michigan, owner of Brian's Lawn Maintenance, a big supporter and a fine, dedicated user. All right, check this out. We just did the Billy Goat thing, live stream. Corey Lanfear, what's up, brother? What's up, what's going on? Dude, this guy's always smiling, always <laughs> got a great attitude. How's the show? Good, good. It's been a while since I've been down, so it's awesome. Six years. Yeah, it's Lots grown changed. a lot. Oh, yeah. Yeah, are you like? A lot bigger, a lot more equipment, a lot more famous people. Whatever, dude. <laughs> 
Have you? Has anybody recognized you? You got deep pockets. You got. No. You come over here, you snap your fingers, and you buy a 50 no units of anything. Me. No one knows. That's a shame. I'm gonna be like, hey, this guy's got money. You know what I'm saying? But uh, hey, thanks for stopping by, brother. Yeah. This yeah. Is good awesome. luck today. Hey, if you guys don't know, we had him on the shop tour. Was it in the spring? Yes. This year's spring. Yes. Yeah, that was awesome. Thank you. Beautiful outfit down in uh, Medina, Ohio. Correct. Yep. Incredible setup. Thank you. I got more engagement comments. I want to be like that guy on that video than probably anybody else in the spring. Humbling. For real. Yeah. You guys got it going on. And uh, your brother, right hand guy, red hair? Marcus. Marcus. The mowing manager. Yeah. Division manager, yes. Marcus was awesome too. Yes. He was cool hand Luke. He was, yeah. There you go. All right, hey, we'll catch up with you guys here in a minute. Thanks for stopping by. Yep. All right, so we're still over here at the Billy Goat booth. Harlan, right? Yeah, Harlan Jones. Jones Property Management, Knoxville, Tennessee. Dude, this is crazy. So how did you get started, and then how's business going? All right, so I got started. I uh, was in sales, always liked mowing grass. I uh, wanted to learn how to be a lawn care professional. So I Googled that. Uh, Brian came up. Uh, article said you need to have uniforms and safety cones. I did that, but I also watched one of his videos. So watching the video, first year in business, 26,000. Next year, 86, 100. 10, 250 this year we'll do a half a million uh, so a half a million dollars into, four uh, years five years in i don't know how you really want to say it started in 2019 but this is our fifth season mowing full time so, so i only have one question for you do you have Wisconsin, uniforms and safety cones oh yeah every yeah. Well no one no one mows without so uniforms and we put safety cones out at every stop that's awesome hey thanks for the testimony keep the hammer down brother yeah thank you all right guys all right guys so over here we're in the h and a side of things and uh check this out what do we got? What do we got? Get ready. Ah! Hey! There you go. What's up, guys? What's yeah. up? Lauren, how we doing? We're doing great. Yeah. Doing good? Lots of action and good conversations. You sound exhausted. I know. <laughs> what are you talking about? Do you hear it? <laughs> you have 100 conversations. Adam yeah. Fullerton, what's up, What's up? What's you're up? You all right? Yeah, we're having fun. This is awesome. This is good? Yeah, we're connecting to so many people here. It's amazing. Yeah, we got the whole crew. Yeah. Uh, give me some feedback. What do you guys think? First show? Uh, this is fun. This is a big show. A lot of different businesses, vendors, exhibitors, everything. So yeah. it's a yeah. great time. There you go. Brandon Bull, what do you guys do? Professional branding. So anything from branding to websites to graphic design work, we got you covered. What do you guys think about first year at Equip Expo? Liz and I have been coming for, I don't know, four or five years. Is it like more than you thought, less than you thought? It exceeded my expectations. Okay. The amount of conversations I've had. Yeah. Um, I felt like we got the value yesterday. Okay. Already. Yeah. I mean, the first few hours. I'm like, this was worth it. And now it's just like double, tripling my expectations. That's awesome. Yeah. I agree completely. It's just there's so many people, again, so many cool businesses and conversations. Just people looking to grow. And I mean, what better place to do it than where they have access to every single resource that they need yeah. at the show. What did you say earlier when people come out like, hey, I know you from Brian's podcast. <laughs> every single person that mentions Brian's, Brian's law maintenance Brian's 10 we double you we double, double it charge. So, um, I think people are getting the idea very quickly that's awesome man that's awesome hey, any party thoughts uh, brandable inc.com yes sir uh, marketing and uh, branding uh, websites you guys did my site uh, we'll leave links in the description you guys have probably seen my podcast and uh, we did some YouTube videos but yep. any any uh, parting thoughts I just want to come over here really quick no we we, we, were, we were lucky to get in here they expanded the uh, the wing and opened this up for everybody so yeah. we love being here and we're already talking about coming back next yep. year all right cool all right yeah. I had to get over here that's why I came over here I'll catch up with you guys all right Yeah, my better side. <laughs> hey, Mike Flett, how to hardscape.com and podcast and not our finest hour. Oh, buddy. Oh, buddy. <laughs> we'll plug it. How's the show, man? It's great. This is the first time here. Yeah. Uh, pretty overwhelming. Yeah. Trying to hit all the boosts. It's awesome. Hey, so really quick, just to slow down, because we're both like level 10 excited right now. So <laughs> you're like joking. You don't know anything going on in turf, quote unquote. And I'm over here, fish out of water. I have no idea what's going on in hardscaping. So give these guys like a minute or so like what do you like here what's going on here who's got a cool booth and uh who should people be paying attention to in hardscaping oh a cool booth I'm, I'm just getting started here so i'm just warming up but belgard obviously here that we're at not to drop any names but yeah, they've fine. got everything porcelain decking so we're just trying to see a little bit more about belgard we just came from the unilock booth that was really cool getting to know their products but porcelain i'm really excited about porcelain so i'm going to be hitting all those booths about porcelain there all right man hardscaping you got 
what I do with Launchpreneur Academy, you do with Hardscaping online with uh, Heart, not the Hardscape Academy, that's the almonds. Well, what's yours? How to Hardscape. Uh, I'm a hardscaper on YouTube if you're interested in that. That's educational content. But How to Hardscape, and we've got software for pricing, budgeting, as well as uh, educational content there as well. What's the website? HowToHardscape.com. You'll find everything there. And then uh, podcast? Podcast How to Hardscape. And as Brian said, if you are uh, willing to take a risk, not our finest hour there. <laughs> <laughs> All right, hey, this guy, I've known him for five, six, seven years now, at least, on social. Always good to get, uh, catch up with familiar faces at the show. Appreciate you saying hey, brother. Thanks, man. All right, man. We'll see you around, right? Enjoy the show. All right. All right, check it out. They're off duty. No, it's good. What's up, dude? <laughs> How we doing, brother? How's it going? Hanging out? Are you taking a break? I was thinking about food right now. Food? Yeah, I need lunch. Let's go get some pretzels. Or some chicken tenders and french fries. <laughs> uh, you got two seconds? Yeah. Absolutely. I missed you guys last year. You guys know Cycle CPA, but uh, they've been on our podcast, doing bookkeeping. Great new reporting coming out. We just did a call, what, like three days ago? Yeah. Tell me what's going on, Joseph. How's it going? Awesome. We're super happy to be here at the expo. Um, really happy to you know see some of the current clients walking around and uh, meeting some new people but yeah um, you know we are going to be uh, launching a newer um, reporting format so showing like benchmarks for industry average trends and cash flow and different things like that so cool. if you are at the expo definitely stop by and check us out if not you can just go to our website to schedule a call and uh, be sure to use the Brian's uh, 10 promo code as well there you go man what do you guys offer because a lot of folks have signed up over the last 24 months yeah. and uh, I'm hearing nothing but good things you guys are doing our books now it's awesome so check it out most of you may have quickbooks online so we'll handle all of the bookkeeping categorizing the transaction reconciling the accounts send you monthly financial reports and then uh you know having a quarterly meeting with you to you know sit down and go over the numbers there you go so. all right i don't want to stay too long carly you got anything you want to add really quick yeah no we're excited about this new reporting software no more looking at boring numbers we have some visual presentation of what your financials look like so much easier to digest and follow so check it out um, we even do demos so there you go feel free to reach out all right girl hey i'm not gonna get away uh in the way of you getting some food <laughs> so i got you go grab me something too hey man all right hey you guys are gonna be at lal by the way yeah absolutely we are. looking all forward right. to it we'll see you guys there all right thank all you right, Brian, all right guys let's keep it going all right so some of you guys saw this on our snow show that we did at uh, the mga 2023 snow show that's the razorback articulating plow i think it's 14 feet or 16 feet absolutely huge and each section will trip and you got the wings as well now the difference between maybe this one and the snow power is that the whole thing will articulate that is freaking crazy uh like 12 or 1300 pounds a little heavy so I'll make sure you guys get a uh, one ton or above hey here we go there you go check that out we got gotcha. you go ahead brother that is sweet Look at that. That's crazy. Ken, you want to say hey to the people? Hey, make sure that you uh, sign up for our truck giveaway in the Yak to Outdoor booth at 445 to end the show. Where you at on IG? Instagram, uh, the underscore stripe life. There you go, boss. Thanks, man. All right, man. How's sure. everything going? Good. It's been busy. Good turnout? Yeah. All right, bro. All right, you guys see all the new stuff here from Echo. Shout out to the Echo folks. Always a good uh, partner and obviously make great products. Got the Echo Gas. 90 tons. Oh, look at this eponymous. That's huge. Wow. The leaf blowers. How are you doing, Brian? Hey, what's up, brother? How are we doing? Hey, I'm Brian. Hello, I'm Brian. Nice to meet you, brother. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Awesome. That's Ed Wright. That's Ed Wright. We are 100%. Commercial. Okay. We don't. We uh, when we started back up in 2020, uh, we did not take on any more residential. We made sure it was all commercial. Uh, it's just something we enjoy doing. Um, get paid in the winter a lot easier, you know. <laughs> <laughs>